Hello, I'm Chris Mikesell uh, with AMD. Uh, what I'm doing here is I'm showing off the Zakate 18 watt processor. Uh, what I'm doing now is I'm showing off uh, City of Heroes. This is City of Heroes Going Rogue. It's a uh, online based MMORPG. And what I'm just trying to showcase here is this is our Zakate processor. It's a very, very small form factor. You've actually you've seen the pictures, so you know how big it is. Um, and it's able to play mainstream games at decent frame rates. It's a playable, playable frame rates. As long as we can tell and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to pit this up against the uh, Core i5 system, running with all the same settings. Uh, all the same settings. You'll notice it's in uh, right now. It's set to uh, 1024 by 768, and set to performance mode right now. So you can see here, we're, for the most part, on average, we're getting about twice the frame rates as the Intel. Now I'm going to go ahead and shut down the game here. I'm going to show you Internet Explorer 9. It's a preview version. I'm going to showcase uh, some HTML5 demos. And what we're looking at here is Amazon Shelf. Let's see, kind of an application Amazon is making in HTML5 to showcase to showcase books as if it's in a like a, a bookstore, like a shelf. And I'm just changing the pages here. This is this is all GPU accelerated, but it's using the onboard uh, Intel HD integrated graphics. It's a Core i5. It's the M520. And we can just see it's going pretty slow. The frame rate down here. If you look, you might want to zoom in on it. The frame rate is about 15 frames a second. And now we'll move over to the Zakate. <coughs> I gotta exit out of the game. And I'm gonna go ahead and run the same Amazon shelf here. Just so we can see. You can just see the experience is just so much more smooth. The frame rate is a lot faster. The frame rate is about double, maybe even uh, triple. And then, yeah, it's it's triple. And we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and actually yeah. just like change some pages here and just show you on the book that it's very smooth, very fluid, changing pages. And when the books like fly in, it's very fast in comparison. Another test I can run is uh, this psychedelic browsing. And I'll just let that run its course. You might not be able to see this in the video, but the end result you'll see. End result. That's the revolutions per minute. Excuse me. And running the same test on the Core i5. First off, we have to wait for it to load. Okay. This one will take about 25 seconds to finish. And what you're seeing here is it's about the ten a tenth of the speed on the Core i5. And that is my demonstration. So, thank you.